Pisces, song I was playing for you was Can I? I feel like Virgo or Gemini had this yesterday. You and them been on the same type of time, high key, so you might be dealing with a Virgo, you might be dealing with a Gemini. Song I was playing before this one was No Flocking, and the song I was playing before that one is Vaz Ballet. Now you, now you saying Can I? It's almost like you may be in a position where you want to express yourself somewhere, and you may be asking for assistance third dimensionally you may you could be asking for a ride somewhere or you're just asking so it's like you're expressing someone to assist you with the proper mentalities on how to carry out a certain type of task you it's like you asking for advice you feel me or you may be questioning if you can even obtain and or do something can i really do this is this possible is this tangible can i make this happen you feel me you know what side of the fence you fall on or that's what somebody trying to figure out with you. Can I really approach Pisces like this? Can I really achieve this by expressing myself towards Pisces like that? You feel me? Or somebody could just be asking for your assistance in some way, shape, or form. Or you're asking for someone else's assistance. Yeah, who you want to be, Pisces, before it get dark? Who you want to be? What you want to do? What you want to express? Yeah, you know the truth about something, Pisces. Yeah, now look, the moon day, you go on the bottom in reverse, though. So now, whether it's like you could have became aware, it's like you knew the truth, but you may have had to experience or go through some pretty sour shit in order to get to this point. Whatever that point was. Now you know about that now. And now it's like, now that you know that, you may be in a position where you want to express and or take your mind somewhere. You've been through some, you've been through the fire about some shit to bring you to this awareness now. We ain't going to act like your secrets wasn't exposed. You ain't go through some turmoils. You ain't go through some emotional, you a little emotional damage. You feel me? You go. You went through some emotional shit to become aware of what the, of the truth you know. But it's like you may. It's like you know the truth, but you almost you don't want to accept it. You don't want that to be the truth, because it's the Queen of Swords upright and the Queen of Coins in reverse. You know the truth, but you don't want that to be the truth. No, that's not how it is. It can't be like that. This can't be how it happens. This can't be the way this goes. Type shit. You feel me? Shit, if it's you versus someone outside of you, it's like you may know why if it's if it's you versus someone outside of you in the sense where someone outside hypnotized and then the moon could be like illusions and shit. Something will never be balanced. Something can never work. You may not you may be in denial about that fact, but it, it that's just how it is. If it's you versus someone outside of you in the sense where someone outside of you could could not see or no longer sees the space they share with you as stable. It's like they don't when they think about sharing or investing in a situation with you, Pisces, it, it don't it, they don't see no solid ground there. So it's like someone outside of you knows something will never work. You know, you know why someone thinks this way about the space they share with you, but you don't want it to be that way. Hey, this was in your last one in the same position, Pisces. You might, you and deny. You know the truth, but the, you don't, you can't, it's like you can't accept the truth. If it's you versus someone outside of you, someone outside of you manipulated you into doing something or expressing yourself in a certain type of way or thinking a certain type of way about something or someone and that put you in a position it's like them manipulating you and that mentality that mind frame put you in the position to take an action you can't come back from regarding that friendship regarding that relationship regarding that job now and you now you know the truth about that situation uh, but that truth came through one hell of a lesson huh And it's like you can't accept it. You don't want to accept it. You're in denial. The Queen of Coins in reverse and the High Priestess in reverse. The High Priestess trumped the Queen of Swords. 
up up and down the street. You feel me? Look, you can't accept it. Look, that that son. Look, you stuck in your head about some shit. You, you whether you lost some friends, you lost a relationship, you lost a job, or you just lost feelings for because of something external to you. Either you let somebody plant a bad seed inside of your mind about a certain topic, subject, or situation, or you planted that motherfucker your damn self. Regardless, you took an action. You know why something is the way it is. First card is Queen of Swords, but you don't want to. You don't want to know that. High Priestess and the Queen of Coins. You don't want to be in this position. It can't be like that, said Pisces. This isn't how it's supposed to be. This isn't the way it was supposed to go. Type shit. You feel me? Yeah, look, you made a bad judgment. Now you out your head. You you had to learn the lesson. You had to become aware of the moon somehow. Now that you aware, it's like, nah. Hey, put your foot though, Pisces. You know what that means for you. You know if this even applies to you. If it's you, I think you got the, you have the Queen of Swords upright, Queen of Coins reverse, Queen of Cups reverse. Like Pisces, what's good? You, you not you, you, you. It's a whole lot of denial right now, Pisces. You may be going through some motions, and it's like you know why. You know the truth as to why you're going through these motions because of a judgment you made in the past. And that you're now more emotionally aware of that caused you to lose these friends, caused you to lose this relationship, caused you to lose these ideas, mentalities, and feelings that you can't get back. You don't want to accept that, though. Portland. Screen crack. Better not ever hesitate. Don't come around and think again. Say. Don't like the way you yeah, you made a decision. It ain't that the judgment made a decision, right? Uh, no, or you making a decision now, or somebody outside of you made a decision on the space with you. You put your foot in the shoe because of the the space or the energy here. You're not expressing the truth. You know, you you're not expressing truth at all. But it's getting hard for you to fake it now. It's getting hard for you to fake it now, ain't it, Pisces? Yeah, come on. Hey, you falling. A decision you made. You got look at all these wings. You a decision you made. You fall. It made you fall. In whatever realm of reality we talk, you might have got fired. Might have got lost your job. Might have lost a friend. Might have lost a relationship. You lost something or you're losing something. You can't accept the fact that you're losing it, though. But a decision you made, made you fall. Third dimensionally, we tell you whether it's other people's perspectives of you and they don't think so highly of the space or the situation they share with you. If they just don't think so highly of you, period, because of what you was investing in, in your past, yesterday, back in the day, or what you was expressing and how the emotions you were feeling, if, how you carried yourself, you feel me? Or... It's just you falling from like your mind is in a very low place right now. Because it's a decision you made. Now you're in that you're stuck in a certain headspace. You're stuck thinking a certain type of way about something. You got a whole lot of wings, Pisces. Now put your foot in the shoe that fits you, Pisces. 